Hi everyone, today's flip along is Mother Goose's Pajama Party, written by Dana Smith and illustrated by Virginia Allen. Starlight, star bright, come to story time tonight. Bring your friends and don't be late. Meet at my house, half past eight. Mother Goose. The moon was first to see the note. She showed the cow what mother wrote. The cow told dish and dish told spoon. Spoon told cat who fiddled a tune. Cat whispered to a boy named John with one shoe off and one shoe on. Jack a dandy filled a sack and slung his treats across his back. Wee Willie Winkie spread the word and Georgie Porgie overheard. He told Bo Peep with one quick kiss, then shared it with another miss, who left behind her curds and whey and ran to pick a bright bouquet. Mary Mary picked one too, while Betty tried to find her shoe. Nimble Jack, so spry and quick, led them with his candlestick. They came upon a crooked house, a crooked man and crooked mouse. Then all together, single file, they walked the final crooked mile. Right on time at half past eight, they marched through Mother Goose's gate. They dressed in jammies, old and new. Mother Goose wore PJs, too. Handy Spandy Jack-a-Dandy shared his cake and sugar candy. They gathered in the reading nook with Mother Goose's famous book. She read of those who sat beside her, dish and spoon and muffet spider. She read of those who were not there, like Simple Simon at the fair. She read of ships and seas they roam. She read until Peep's sheep came home. With happy hearts and bellies stuffed, yawns were yawned and pillows fluffed. She kissed each little sleepy head and tucked them soundly into bed. Then Mother Goose blew out the light. Sleep, my children, sweet dreams. Good night. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Starlight, star bright. Starlight, star bright. First star I see tonight. I wish I may, I wish I might. Have the wish I wish tonight. The cat and the fiddle. Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such sport and the dish ran away with the spoon. Diddle diddle dumpling. Diddle diddle dumpling, my son John, went to bed with his trousers on. One shoe off and one shoe on. Diddle diddle dumpling, my son John. Handy Spandy Jack a Dandy. Handy Spandy Jack a Dandy loves plum cake and sugar candy. He bought some at the grocer's shop and out he came. Hop, hop, hop. Wee Willy Winky. Wee Willy Winky runs through the town, upstairs and downstairs in his nightgown. Tapping at the window, crying at the lock. Are all the children in their bed? It's past 10 o'clock. Little Bo Peep. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, wagging their tails behind them. Georgie Porgy. Georgie Porgy Puddin' and Pie kissed the girls and made them cry. When the boys came out to play, Georgie Porgy ran away. Little Miss Muffet. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider who sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. Mary, Mary, quite contrary. Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow? 
with silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row. Betty Blue Little Betty Blue lost her holiday shoe. What can little Betty do? Give her another to match the other, and then she may walk in two. There was a crooked man. There was a crooked man, and he walked a crooked mile. He found a crooked sixpence upon a crooked stile. He bought a crooked cat, which caught a crooked mouse, and they all lived together in a little crooked house. Jack be nimble. Jack be nimble, Jack be quick. Jack jump over the candlestick. Simple Simon. Simple Simon met a pieman going to the fair. Said Simple Simon to the pieman, let me taste your ware. Sent the pieman to Simple Simon, show me first your penny. Said Simple Simon to the pieman, indeed I have not any. Simple Simon went a-fishing for to catch a whale, but all the water he could find was in his mother's pail. Simple Simon went to look if plums grew on a thistle. He pricked his fingers very much, which made poor Simon whistle. He went to catch a dicky bird and thought he could not fail, because he had a little salt to put upon its tail. He went for water with a sieve, but soon it all ran through. And now poor simple Simon bids you all adieu. I saw a ship a-sailing. I saw a ship a-sailing, a-sailing on the sea. And oh, but it was laden with pretty things for thee. There were comfits in the cabin and apples in the hold. The sails were made of silver and the masts were made of gold. Thanks for reading along with us. Come back next time for another story.